hello. It's Nancy today. Hello, hello. I'm out here with my incense on my arms and on my hair so that I can be free of the mosquitoes. Anyway, um, I was going to tell you, since I'm doing this, I thought I should tell you. Um, this is a thistle. And so I clipped it with my clippers. Da -dum, da -dum. And I um, am peeling it from the bottom. I mean, yeah, I cut it at the bottom, right? It was sitting over here. There's another one. Anyway, I cut it at the bottom and I've been peeling it and eating it. Now that's going to be a trick, showing you how I'm doing it. I could put you right there. Maybe I could put you right here. It's going to be difficult because you can't peel with one hand. Okay, so I'll hold it with this finger. Between those fingers. And then I shall peel it. Oops. Better grip. Okay, Nancy, there we go. And then I shall very gently, ouch, the mosquito. Alright, so I peel it, and inside is this. It was very much like celery. A deer bounded through this spot a little while ago. I wonder if he left his fawn. She left her fawn. So if I went backwards from the way she had come, you know, I would find her. Anyway, okay, we're going to get back to this. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to lay you on the ground. Because that's the only way I can use two hands. Okay, so. Well, you peel it. Just like celery. Very much. Ouch. Don't tuck it under your arm. See, you pull off the strings. It's really good. Amazing. Somebody said, you see, and when you pull them, I don't know if you can see this, but see, it pulls the spines off with it. So you don't get, you don't get prickled at all. I wish I could show you how it's coming off there, see? And so you can eat the leaves too, once you've taken off the spine. They're very tasty. They're kind of plain, you know? I wonder if you're recording. Okay, so, I'll do it again. Let's see if I can put it over like this. Okay, so I'm going to pull this and see how it just takes, goes off. Hey, do you have a leaf in your face? <gasps> oh, something was wrong. Okay, so here we go. So you peel it. And it just peels right down the whole thing. Just like when you have broccoli stems, you can peel the broccoli stems. This is very similar to a broccoli stem. This is a very good example. See how it's all peeled? And the strings are just like celery. Oh, you peeled them off, right? This all for breakfast. Excellent idea, eh? Unbelievable how it works. It makes it very edible. Very easy to eat. Yeah. See if I can do this right in front of you. And see how it's just peeling away there? My husband has been out here digging these things up for a while. I'm trying to eradicate them. But not anymore. I think I ate my whole stem. No, I have a little bit here at the top. Now those little tiny leaves, look at them. Oh, let's just finish peeling this.
Well, I think these little bits are going to be quite edible too. Totally different flavor. Kind of like spinach. I mean, it's acquired taste, right? I'm not going to eat those. But I guess I should show you that you can. Okay, so. Continue peeling. I can. As soon as you remove the center spine, this center spine does not look very prickly here. I don't think you need to remove it, that one. No, it's okay. It's a little bit wild, you know? It's not the same as iceberg lettuce. So. But it's it's much milder than something like arugula, arugula or whatever that is. Celery. And just a, diff, a little bit different taste of celery. As soon as I finish it, I'm on another one. So, just now we're going to go look for one, right? I wonder if you were off. Oh, you recorded! Bless your heart. Alright, let's go see if we can find another one. Better look at the time. 7.30. I don't have much time. Gotta go to church. Okay, so. There should be some up here. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? That's for catching all the mosquitoes. Don't kill the spiders, they kill them, they catch all the mosquitoes. I don't see any more. He's done such a wonderful job of getting rid of them. So I have here grass growing up. I was gonna look this, I, th I think this is canary grass. Every year I learn about all these things and then I have to learn them again. Such a pain. I guess that's called review. Anyway, so now I'm